Hey friends, how are we? Are you ready for a craft? We're going to be making some paint hyacinths. Let's jump in. For today's craft, you're going to have a piece of blue paper, a piece of green paper. You're also going to want scissors, a bottle, and you should also have purple paint. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be using the bottle to um, paint. We're going to use the lid. I like to keep the bottle like closed all together. It's just a lot easier to hold. But before that, we're going to take our green piece of paper and I like like three fits really nicely. And I'm just going to cut three strips. And then once I've cut my three strips, I like to make them different lengths just because flowers are often different lengths. I'm just going to cut a little bit off. And so now I have three different sizes. And I'm going to then glue these down using a glue stick. Once they're all glued, this is where the fun part, we get to start painting. So what we're going to do, I'm going to move this so you can see better. So what we're going to do is we're going to take our bottle and we're going to dip it. And you want to try to dip it as lightly as possible, kick off any extra. And then we're going to use this to do circles up the sides of the stems. Sometimes when it's a little, they're a little see-through, I like to go back and just kind of press through, get it kind of up, up. And then you're going to do the other side. And they don't have to be a perfect straight line, so don't feel like that's something you need to make sure happens. We're just going to kind of go up, stem. And then once you get to the top, I just like to put one right at the top. And then we're gonna do this for the other two stems. And once you're done, you're going to sit and you're gonna let it completely dry before we move on to the next step. So this is one I have completely dried and I'm going to take my remaining bits of um, green paper and I'm going to cut out leaves. So hyacinths have long, long skinny leaves. So they're going to look a little something like this. Um, I like to first just do a nice big one and then kind of see. So I like, I like how that looks. Mm, that's nice. And then I'll do the other leaves off camera. Once I have all my leaves, I'm going to take my glue stick and then I'm going to glue them on. So I'm just gonna coat them.
I like to make sure I put a lot of glue just to kind of help them stick especially over the paint. Sometimes that could be a little tricky. And there you have it. You have your hyacinths. Aren't they so cute? So this is going to be the last craft for April. Because um, next week is the Easter holiday. And so I'll be seeing you guys in May. Have a great one. Bye.